Okay, hi there YouTube, friends and subscribers. Uh, this is going to be kind of a PSA message to people out there. My day started off with a bang, a big one, actually an explosion. I don't know if you're going to see this on the camera, but my windshield's broken. Now that I've had a while to put this all together, what happened uh, earlier today so I was out early this morning, did a little grocery shopping, fueled up my truck, and as I was leaving the uh, fuel station, turned the wheel to the left, turned the wheel to the right, and boom, the airbag went off. Now I'm going to jump up in the cab. As you can see, it's fully deployed, and I can tell you it hurt like hell when it went off. And I've been trying to figure out how the windshield got broken. And then I started looking around <clears throat> and I noticed my boost gauge here is twisted. I'm not even going to show you that. That's about an inch and a half gouge I've got in my wrist. I had my hand up here on the wheel when the bag went off, causing my wrist to go in over here to the boost gauge and my knuckles went through the windshield so that's how the windshield broke so the bottom line is I don't know if it's gonna do it now this has been going on for about a week I don't know if you can see the airbag light down there that airbag lights been coming off and on say not one out well it's back on again and it's been doing that for about a week and rather than uh, looking into it or pulling the fuse out of it I did nothing, and today I had the uh, explosion happen right in the gas station, luckily for me. And if there's a bright side to this, I'm glad it didn't happen on my road trip because uh, in two more weeks I'm going back up to Tennessee to look at some more land. And then about oh, two weeks after that I'm going up to New Hampshire again with you know the camper and the whole bit on the back. So that would have been unbelievably bad driving down the highway and having this happen. Why did it happen? I have no idea. It didn't hit anything. There was no accident. It just blew. And this just reinforces all my feelings about these newer vehicles. I knew this is, you know, a 20-year-old truck. I hate airbags. I hate anti-lock brakes. I hate computers on vehicles. I hate anything I can't control. And here's another good reason why. So, the moral of this story is, if you see your airbag light come on, don't do what I did. Uh, look into it yourself, or if you don't know how to do that, bring it somewhere and get it looked at, because I can attest this is no fun when these go off. And uh, I was kind of dazed for about a minute. I don't know if my arm's going to show up now, but it was a lot redder a little while ago. And my knuckles, well, there's a piece of glass in it. My knuckles were pretty black. I couldn't figure out why my knuckles were black. Well, they were black because I punched the windshield up. That's how the windshield got broken. So anyway, that's what happened to me today. And uh, as I said, if you ever have your uh, airbag light comes on in your car or truck or whatever, definitely go get it looked at because I can assure you this was no fun. And had I been traveling down the highway... This would have been really bad, because it went off all by itself. There was uh, no reason for it to go off, and it, it just did. So, tomorrow I get a new windshield, luckily. And uh, look around for another steering, bag, uh, steering wheel, and immediately ditch the airbag out of it, so this never happens again. So I'm just sharing that today. This could have been real bad. Again, if you have warning lights on your airbag, on your vehicle, Airbag warning lights, come on. Go get it looked at. Alright, I hope this helps somebody not do what I did. When the light comes on, check it out. Alright. We're all good here. Everything's good to go. Got a new windshield coming. No big deal. Thanks for watching. Bye.